To the untrained eye, southern residents and bigs orcas, also known as transients, may look alike. But whale researchers have known their differences for decades. Their jaws, calls, behavior, fins and sizes are all different. Notably, bigs eat mammals and have plenty of food, while southern residents stick to less plentiful salmon, leading to their endangered status. A new study combines that knowledge with genetic data to argue each should officially be named its own species. The scientific community that's finally caught up, and I think that's mainly due to improvement in genetic sequencing techniques. Dr. David Bain with the Orca Conservancy is hopeful this could lead to more distinctions, listing southern residents as endangered. But most of all, he hopes it stresses the need for more action to remove dams, protect habitats, reduce air and water pollution, regulate fishing, and prepare for disease outbreaks. What we really need to do is take a shared burden approach where we ask everybody to do a little bit toward their recovery uh, rather than you know, trying to identify a couple scapegoats and you know, make their lives miserable. The Taxonomy Committee of the Society of Marine Mammalogy could make a decision this summer. If approved, both bigs and southern residents would get their own new species names. And the study argues that bigs and southern residents stopped reproducing thousands of years ago and are really on opposite sides of the family tree, Joyce. Which is so interesting because if they're so different, why were they lumped together in the first place? Right, exactly. And so, I mean, just think about you or me who maybe aren't a totally trained eye. They do have similar markings, similar coloring. Mm -hmm. But, you know, scientists have noted that even in the 70s, they knew that the animals didn't mix with each other even when they were in the same waters at the same time. So they have just separated themselves. No contact there and separate species, mm -hmm. as they should so be. So we'll see how should that happens this, this summer. They're going to make that final decision in terms of taxonomy. So we'll see what happens. Yeah. You'll let us know, of course. Thanks, Joyce. Thanks.